Hey guys, you're watching Catch Up on a Forever TV where we bring you what's been trending on social media. The secrecy surrounding the dating life of Nigerian rapper and actor Eke Chuku has been unveiled. He posted a picture of himself and his fiance on his Instagram page with a beautiful caption in which he said the reason why he kept the relationship a secret is because of pressures from the industry, but now he's ready to move to the next level and stop hiding. Though the identity of the girl is still a mystery, we wish him all the happiness in the world. There's a report that comedian Helen Paul will soon become a professor in the United States of America. According to The Nation, while studying to become a professor, she is also working as a lecturer in one of the institutions in the United States. It's interesting to note that she only completed her PhD in theater arts from the University of Lagos last year. Nollywood actor Kanayo Okanayo has undergone a major nasal surgery just a few days after being called to bar. Nigerian blogger Linda Ikeji turned 40 recently and to celebrate the day she bought 85 shoes. On her Instagram, she said she wanted to buy 40 to mark her 40th birthday but was mesmerized by how beautiful the shoes were so she couldn't stop shopping. What can I say? I'm all for self-love but 85 shoes? That sounds a bit excessive. Speaking of birthdays, Nigerian music icon Tufis Edivia got a surprise birthday party from his wife recently to celebrate his 45th birthday. We wish you happy birthday from a forever team. <laughs> West is at it again. Now, the billionaire rapper shared a disturbing tweet where he hinted about getting murdered and his daughter Nord being taken away from him. In the meantime, there's a report that Kim Kardashian is set to divorce him. According to Page Six, the rapper's bipolar disorder and his anti abortion stance have taken a toll on their already crumbling marriage. Speaking of divorce, rumors have been circulating that American rapper Cardi B filed for divorce from her husband offset because he's expecting a child with another woman. While Cardi B and her team is shutting down the rumors, saying there's no other child. According to Page Six, she is even thinking about resolving the divorce amicably because of their two-year-old daughter. Nigerian singer Yemi Alade has slammed those who always go about blaming women after their partners cheat. In a series of tweets, she said, no matter how good you are, you might never be completely good enough for some people. She further asked why it's easy to blame a woman when a man cheats, but when a woman does the same thing, she's called a slut. Good question. What are your thoughts on that story? Leave a comment right down below. Here is a video of Nigerian superstar Davido playing drums during a praise and worship service in a church in Asaba. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for this edition of Catch Up. Don't forget to click that subscribe button and make sure to follow us on all our social media platforms.